I would like to give you a clear picture about how to plan for a house in Canada. See my dear friends, husband and wife both are having $100,000 of income and they are thinking to buy a home. So the most important account they should have in order to get the tax deductible option is registered retirement savings plan and first time home savings account. So both of them at the maximum level that's what I have calculated over here. So the maximum amount that they can withdraw is 35,000 per person in case of registered retirement savings plan and in case of FHSA to $40,000 each. It will take almost five years to get that entire room filled. Now comes another question. What's the main advantage that is going to happen in our life when you contribute to these particular accounts? So that's what I have shown possible tax return. So that's the output or the advantage that you will be able to receive once you fully filled your registered retirement plans. It can be FHSA or RRSP. So it varies with the different provinces. Now I'm just going to show different provinces. So starting with uh, Ontario, you can see a person with a taxable income of $100,000. If he is able to contribute $35,000, he's able to get back almost an amount equal to $10,000. With the Quebec, it's going to be 12700 almost. And with the Alberta, it's going to be $10,675. With the BC, it's going to be $10,000 approximately. And with the Manitoba, it's going to be 12584 New Brunswick, it's going to be 12166 And in Newfoundland, it's going to be 12472 And these values depends upon what tax margin that they collect from you guys. So... In different provinces these amounts vary i'm just taking a random value just to show that how much advantage that you are eligible to get once if you contribute properly to these accounts and i'm just taking uh, the particular value just as an example which is ten thousand dollars and i'm gonna input it to that same scenario which we have discussed before which is a husband and wife scenario which we have discussed just a few minutes back so the same scenario i am taking ten thousand dollars of an average the maximum that they can receive for that particular $35,000 just an average value which is $10,000 out of all the provinces which we have calculated before and the possible tax return that you are eligible to get is almost an amount equal to $10,000 similarly depending upon the contribution room for FHSA 2 you will be able to get at least three to seven thousand dollars depending upon how many amount of room you have with the same scenario you calculated with the husband situation where he gets the same benefit which is ten thousand dollars for that additional amount of money and around six thousand around three to seven thousand dollars for that particular fhsa account depending upon the contribution rule see my dear friends if you calculate all of this amount with the smallest possible tax return amount it would be at least it would be at least tax saving amount of $13,000 my dear friends that's not a small amount of money as long as you allocate to proper accounts this is what you are able to get it back so for a husband and wife $13,000 plus $13,000 which is equal to $26,000 of extra money that's going to be coming out of it and this will be a major benefit when you plan for your first home so this is something like a beautiful concept of registered account which you can make use when you buy your first home so this is just an approximate amount don't take me wrong this is just an approximate value so this is the minimum benefit minimum tax benefit that you will be able to get make use of these kinds of account so that you can save some amount of tax and it's all about a proper planning so in every situation what i would suggest is talk to a financial professional who have proper knowledge with him Talk to a licensed financial professional who can give you a good suggestion. It's not about how much money you have in your hand. Situations may vary, but just understand the basic concept and use your money in a wise way. So I hope you guys got a clear picture about how to plan for a house using registered account. I will be posting more videos. Follow for more contents. Thank you.